Hello, this is a FCS John again. I am doing a review on a NC Motorsports adjustable rear shock. Um, here's the information here, the part number. Um, I'm using this on my 2007 Honda Ruckus that I have a non-fatty GUI 6 swap on. It comes with the shock itself that you see right here and two spanners the shock here is adjustable it has a lower collar and these two upper collars here where you use a spanner wrench to adjust the ride height and the quality of the ride so currently i have this pre-adjusted to my liking where i need it to be before i install it uh, my only big gripe about it here is the fact that the, the spanner tools seem not to be really designed for this. I mean, they seem to have, this one seems too small and this one's way too big. The side don't even work. The side seems too small and it scuffs up the iodizing on the collars, which is not that terrible. Um, to adjust it, like I said, it was pretty easy. You use the spanner wrench to break this one free and you can adjust it. I currently have it to where I believe it's the safest height for the height wise and I have it locked down and then I have this up a little bit higher for a little bit stiffer ride and also to get a little more height out of the uh, the strut. Um, build quality other than that seems pretty good once again. This is designed for the GUI 6. It has that bevel cut. Very nice, very, very nice uh, strut here. I'm looking forward to installing it. Um, I am a little disappointed. There's not a whole lot of instructions. It's just a little instruction pamphlet here talking about how to position, position the collar on a stock ruckus, um, which this is not a stock ruckus, so I'm not too worried about it. But there you go. Um, that's the NCY rear strut I'm running. It's not the low boy or low down or anything like that. And once again, this is the parts information. If you want to pause the video to get the all the specs off of this. Any questions, concerns, you can message me. And once again, this is FGS John. Thank you.